Now most of the room's the same as it was, except for it's been moved up that end and it's all on shelves down here and there's also now a big layout. Still unfinished. It's going to take many years. I would have thought. Now also new additions are the Atlas models, which I've now signed up for. Got my first two down here. Hopefully I'll get them another one soon. There's my new shelving unit. And come over here is the old display unit we had. Goes into the cupboards. And on the shelf. And the, with the folders. And into the chest we've got all the old clothes, even the cotton banner. And the special Mark Dixon t shirt, the old calendar from last year. And something very special. Which if you look out from the road in the back of the car, it'll be me. I had some specially made. I have my spotter number on it. So, have a quick look now what we've done. So far down here. Still in work in progress as I've said. based on the original board and here's a clip <coughs> I'll go down here for you we've got your office block with your car park for staff and visitors it's a chilled depot chilled ambient this depot is, it's only small it has overnight parking bays for vehicles and just outside of the yard you've got builders merchant and a for sale unit and opposite that on the other side of the road in, which is a converted old stowart depot I've uh, made it a service department where the vehicles are maintained and whatever you Next to that we have the local garage. Again, still in working needs work on it. As the four courts not done. Over the back there we have a fabrication company and a repainted truck to put the name on it with a stove bar delivery to it. In front where these barriers are. It's going to be a row of houses in front, or shops, I haven't decided yet. And next to the fabrication business is a burnt out hotel, which has been burnt out many years and now overgrown with trees. Coming to the village itself, still some builders missing here as well, but you've got your corner shop, one pub, train station which needs finishing off as well, some shops and houses. And here you've got another pub, the car park, and everywhere there's going to be a house being built and empty spot for more houses or shops. And over the other side of the railway line, you've got space for two more houses or half houses. And you've got like some sort of warehouse thing there. And other areas like the fence here, it's not done 100% yet, it's been put up but eventually I will go back and put a like, post down every so often through it to say it looks more realistic, just something that can go back to time and time again, so it will never be finished even when it is. On the shelf up here, above it, you have books and cups and the clock, model, mouse mat, 
And this here is a birthday card I had from them, from Stobart themselves, congratulating me on turning 21. And on top of the uh, depot, I've got my only version of the rugby trucks. We'll be getting more and funds allow me. Of course, there's more cars to be added and more trucks eventually. And now I've got plans to put a little TV in here so I can show my trucks and trailers non stop stuff to myself and yeah it's my little stobot chat room or will be when it is done you may remember in the other video I said the curtains always shut in this room that keeps the light out, the sunlight, so the only means of light is state of lamp shades. Let's so have a closer look on these shelves then. The back we've got the, the uh, forklift truck. It cost me £6 from a model fair, because they're very rare to get hold of. And you've got the first Atlas Editions Emma Jade, and you've got Karen Patricia and you've got a uh, very old Volvo number plate Eddie and you've got another Volvo which is the first um, shipping container and you've got the Atlas model that I bought from the Stobart catalogue which is actually an Oxford die cast model and I call the Atlas ones and this is Teletubby which is a very good model indeed the only thing it is missing is a pop art TV. Next shelf down, we've got the old Mirakonoff UG, some pride, and Erlum Norris. And above it, I've got an UG box, one in the box, because it's worth more. And the next shelf down, got another thing I bought from the Model Fair, the original motorway set. And from the other sets, which are on the model itself, of fuel tanker and stuff and we've got road working stuff and then next to that we've got some more stuff in the box and these feature also on the model or on the shelves and that shelf down is a bit more empty we've got another Emma Jade which someone gave to me as a present and that one has been kept in the box never opened and moving along you've got them in a box Another old Volvo, but this time with the flags on the roof, and a shipping new state of art rail, Corgi. Now I do have them on the model, as you can see. There's one there. I've got the children up there. There's an early one there, and the cab for the early is here with the state in the maintenance yard ready to be painted up. I've also now got a Tesco lorry and a Tesco cab parked up and also on the, the model I've got the tanker but if you go over to the shelves over here I've already got tanker and the normal delivery and sustainable, sustainable distribution and after another one of those or one that says transfer logistics <coughs> and we go up get more models and you got the boxes for the Atlas ones and as we go up across the very rare top of the truck here I've got a fridge magnet an old keyring a biomass keyring a members club badge the badge you got with the Atlas Editions and another Stobart badge. And beyond that we've got the Atlas notebook. I'm trying to get hold of another one which I will use in my car so I can jot down the names. 
ones I spot. And next to that we've got a trackside Lido. Lido, whatever you call it. Models, you've got Eddie Stobart and underneath that United Glass Eddie Stobart. Going along here, you've got your door sticker. It has been used, so it's not as good as it would be. And down a bit in the cup, you've got the old ruler of the road ruler. Very old pen and other pens and pencil. And you've got the original pencil case and some pens. And of course, you've got the from Atlas Editions. Um, coasters. I've got the original Steady Eddie. I seem to have got three of them for some reason. Steady. And there's a poster about joining the fan club. A picture of Mark Dixon on it. And I've got some depot people. My second lot, because there's a lot are on the, the yard here. Some of them are actually quite well worn. That's why I bought another box. They're very rare, very expensive to get hold of now. And that you can hear ticking away is my original clock, which started. They bought them to make them when I posted this picture in one year. As I've already told you in the previous videos. Now, I don't know if I have this. If I, I told you that I went to Stobart Fest, or if you saw it in my previous videos, I picked of uh, Mark, Dixon, Mark Dixon's autograph now and a picture with Mark Dixon um, and I'll show you that just now also from Stobart Fest I've got this top which is like the driver's one I've got that Mark Dixon one of course you've got the black one in there you've got that cup i got from there I also got quite a few models, which I can't remember which, I'll have to check my uh, other videos. So yeah, I'll show you a bit more slideshow of photos here and there around the place. You might notice the buildings that move around on each photo. I wanna be a Maddie Stobart driver Feeling the wheel is where I wanna be Stobart driver, oh, uh, the finest firm in haulage history. I wanna be a Maddy Stobart driver. Nowadays we all sing in his praise. Oh, let me be a Maddy Stobart driver. Cause Eddie Stobart rules the motorways. You know, I want to hear the children. I want to hear them cheer like they cheer Eddie when he overtakes us from afar. Oh, wow. With his fan club expanding, he just leaves the others standing. I love to be a Stobart. And, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll keep you posted as I finish bits and bobs. I really hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching and tune in again soon.